hello and welcome to my channel this is shiba and today i'm here with a full face makeup tutorial i haven't done one of these kind of videos for a long time so here i am today i'll show you from my face primer to lipstick everything you need to see let's get started with face primer the primer i'm using here today is lauric pro skin glass skin face primer this is oh a game changer i love this primer a lot this primer creates a beautiful canvas for the entire face makeup and it's so silky and very hydrating at the same time so i love it and for foundation today i'm going very old-fashioned i'm going for this max studio fix stick foundation this is in shade nc30 and i will blend this out using a real technique face brush For concealer, I'm going for this NYX Cosmetics Bear With Me Concealer Serum today. This is a very popular serum concealer for some reason right now. And uh, I just recently uploaded a review and try on on this concealer. So if you would like, check that video out. I'll add the link in the description box and it will also show up in the top of the video. I'm using the same concealer as my eyeshadow base and also under my eyes. For contouring, I usually use a dark shade of concealer. So here I'm going with Pore Cosmetics Disappearing in Concealer. I always like to keep my makeup look as natural as possible. So I do not use too much product on my face. It may look beautiful on the camera, but in person, when you use too much product, it doesn't look um, as good. So I try to show what I actually would wear in a regular regular basis so i'm not going with like some really really high pigmented um contouring and stuff like that so i go with very natural and minimum as much as you need so as you can see it gives a pretty good uh, contouring just it brings back the natural shape of my face that i lost because of the foundation so that's basically the main purpose of contouring and bronzing so i'm use i ha i've been using here the hola bronzer uh, by benefit cosmetics and here i'm using blush and for blush i like to keep it very natural like i said i don't know how many times i've been mentioning the same thing um so to make it more natural with blush i put a little bit of around my nose like from cheek to cheek and to the nose area that just gives it more natural looking instead of just some pink color popping on your cheek so that's my style but whatever you like go for it and as for highlighter i'm using the becca cosmetics highlighter and i believe this is in shade moonlight by the way but i believe becca cosmetics is out of business right now i'm not very sure but oh my gosh this has been my favorite for so long i have to find something different now um for eyeshadow today i'm using this natasha denona zendo palette i don't think i have uploaded any video about this palette yet so this is the first time i'm using this palette on camera camera um i've been using it um like in my everyday makeup look for a long time now but i haven't really uploaded a video actually i should probably um this is a beautiful palette i mean this is natasha denona eyeshadow palette what not to love about it it's so gorgeous beautiful color palette beautiful um color story very well pigmented and i love it it has some everyday wearable eyeshadows and it also has some really popping uh, greens and blues and stuff like that and the eye look that i'm going for today is pretty simple i'm keeping it really really simple um just going for some um what do you call it like peachy um 
not really burgundy but like some peachy kind of shades in my crease and then a sparkly shade on Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and be a part of my YouTube family. I love you all. Bye-bye.